Hi guys, it's Kaz and Harry here at Thelmere Deacon. Uh, we wanted to have a quick conversation about a topic that is, has been coming up a lot when we're speaking to our clients, um, and that's inflation. It's been all over the news recently, and as I said, we've been talking about it a lot. So we just wanted to sort of you know, cover that. And yeah, see. definitely, definitely. And, and just go over it in a bit more detail because whether you are reading the news reports or whether you're having conversation about property at the moment, um, and not even necessarily property, inflation is something which is taking the UK by storm. And there's a lot of scam on grip going on. And, and me and Kaz just wanted to kind of educate people what how inflation is affecting the property market and, and what really people can do in order to invest. Yeah, exactly. I think one of the key points when we're looking at inflation um, obviously, you know, if prices are increasing, you know, the cost of living has increased, which isn't fun for anyone. However, when we're looking at purely from a property investment perspective, there are actually a few indications of what's happening within property. So inflation is calculated, a lot of inflation is calculated by house prices and rental growth. So when inflation is increasing, what that does actually indicate is that property prices and rental growth is, is increasing a lot as well. Um, I know you've spoken a lot about Liverpool and Manchester areas and the rental growth that's going on there. Yeah, definitely. So what we've seen in Liverpool and Manchester is we've seen over 18% growth in the rental figures in the last two years alone. Now, the reason why that's relevant and it's constantly a conversation we're having for our investors is because at the moment, most people are being a bit, I don't want to say tired, but they're being a bit more safe with their money. Okay, so they're keeping money, their money in the typical safe havens which is the banks now if we look at the banks at the moment you're lucky to get one percent as an interest rate with inflation up at nine percent as we said you're technically losing a lot of money every year so having such higher growth statistics not only in capital appreciation but also in the rental income shows that you can actually get a return on your money rather than technically losing money every year yeah exactly that, that, that. another a point that a lot of, i've heard a lot of clients say as well is you know, house prices have been growing so much, you know, that's going to have to stop or there's going to be a crash or something like that. Um, and obviously we can't predict what's going to happen with house prices, but what we can do is look at the data. And you can see in certain areas, not everywhere, you know, places like the city centre, Manchester, Liverpool, as you just mentioned, mm -hmm. there's a huge amount of demand and there's a serious lack of supply. And, you know, if that's the case, growth is going to continue and that's it's just the way it works. Yeah, absolutely. At the moment. And you know, with things like COVID, etc., supply has decreased even further than it was before. So you know, that's why we're going to continue probably seeing prices increase. Yeah. Well, the government are failing epically, aren't they, on the amount of houses they're meant to be building per year. Um, so supply is, is really in, in finite at the moment and the demand is increasing every year. I mean, our population is only going one way uh, and that's of course up. So look, if you are interested in investing in property, you want to learn more about how you can invest your money without going to a, a more volatile asset class like the cryptos or the stocks and shares market, then get in touch with even myself or cousin or we'll be happy to help. Yeah, and even if you just want a, a conversation to see how it could work in the future or you know different types of strategies, you know, we're more than happy to help or you know, have a conversation. Perfect. Thank you.